Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression if we have 7 cubed minus 7 square divided by 7 square and here calculator is not allowed in this problem. So this means that we will show all of the working here. So now we solve this problem for two methods uh, and here we discuss our first method <clears throat> and now here in first method we need to focus in the exponent of this term and we break this 7 cubed as 7 to the power of 2 plus 1 minus this is our 7 square divided by this is our 7 square and here if we use here the nice exponential law you know about this law if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so according to this exponent law we break the exponent of these terms and after breaking the exponents it will be written as 7 square multiplied by 7 to the power of 1 minus this is 7 square and it is divided by 7 square and here in the next step we need to break this fraction and we can write this 7 square separately on both of these values and it will become 7 square multiplied by 7 and it is divided by 7 square minus this is also 7 square divided by 7 square and now you see here this 7 square is cancelled out by this 7 square and this 7 square is cancelled out by this 7 square and from here we will get uh, 7 minus from here we will get 1 and when we subtract 7 minus 1 uh, we get here 6 only so this is the final simplified form of the given question which we get here from first method and now we move forward uh, towards the second method uh, and first we rewrite or we copy down given question statement here the given question statement is 7 cubed minus 7 square divided by 7 square this is the our uh, question statement and now we again solve this problem for second method and now here in the second method uh, we uh, break this fraction so now in second method here first we need to break this fraction and when we break this fraction it will be written as 7 cubed over 7 square minus this will be written as 7 square over 7 square so in second method we uh, solve this problem with the help of exponent loss and now here first we know that if we have a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n it will be written as a to the power of m minus n so in this case we just move our lowest exponent towards the highest exponent if we compare these two exponents you see here the lowest exponent is 2 highest exponent is 3 so we move 2 towards 3 and we can apply here this exponent law and in the same pattern we can apply here this exponent law on both of these terms uh, so after applying this exponent law it will be written as 7 to the power of 3 minus 2 minus in this case we have 7 to the power of 2 minus 2 and now you see here we have 7 to the power of 3 minus 2 will be equals to 1 and here we have 7 to the power of 2 minus 2 becomes 0 we know that any number whose exponent is 0 is equals to 1 so we apply here this rule according to this rule 7 to the power of 0 is equals to 1 and 7 to the power of 1 is equals to 7 so we get here 7 minus 1 and finally we have 7 minus 1 becomes here 6 so this is the our uh, final answer of this question uh, and I hope so you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.